Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this video is going to be hopefully short and sweet. Somebody emailed me and asked me how they could turn in the perfect shape happy face. So if you go to your perfect shape and go to a happy face, you can draw a happy face. But they wanted to know how they can engrave that because the even if you change it to, to black and hairline, so we'll just get rid of this one real quick. And even if you change this to black, thick line, thick as you can get, supposedly, and I'll show you that in another bit. You know how you can make the mouth wider? So let's just do that. And I did it in two different scenarios. This is a... Down here, it's a perfect shape on layer one, so we need to convert it to a curve. Then we need to break the curve apart. And then you have this line. Then you go up to effects, contour. I'm going to contour one inch to the outside. Then you can go and break contour apart. And you can click on your red, and you can delete it. And then you can take your Smart Fill tool. Or, if you want to engrave that, or if you want to just engrave it like this, and then you could change everything else. Hold down your alternate key and you'll grab both those three surfaces, the two eyes and the, four, and the head, and make this black. And it is kind of a cool effect. Uh, making his mouth a little wider. But there you go. And then just a little insight. Let's go back to where we had a contour. If you had your, well, if you had your um, Docker open for Object Manager and you wanted to, without zooming in, you wanted to hit the red uh, line, you can see right there we have a red curve where if we click on the other one we have a black curve. So when you're when you're deleting uh, contour lines, if you'll have your object manager open, even if you're zoomed in, it'll help you make sure you delete the right one. Anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Well, another little thing. Let's do this. This is kind of fun. And I'm also going to make another video about this too. But go to your perfect shape and get your happy face. And let's say we want a sad face. Take your shape tool and grab that red handle and make a sad face. Hate to end the note on a sad face. But anyway, hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.